Welcome back to the channel, ladies and gentlemen. I'm your host, Damien from Penventure. Welcome to a new brand on the Penventure website. And uh, in this video, I'm not going to bore you with a presentation and uh, all of that, but I'm gonna go a step further. I'm gonna give you something really interesting a viewpoint, an open window, and how do I pick partners, brands, why certain brands are on the Penventure website and why some of them are not here and the reason behind everything. In the last few weeks, I have gave this video a lot of thinking. I gathered information and most important, I focused on how to deliver this information in order to be received as I view it inside my mind. And the reason behind everything is passion and appreciation towards my viewers, my customers, and the people that I interact with every single day. Let's get into that a little bit later. The new brand, it's Sailor. It's one of the most impressive collaborations of this year. And I'm super happy that my plan at the beginning of the year was followed at each step and we did a good job. I plan to bring three new brands on our website and we deliver that. The Sailor Pen Company is a Japanese uh, pen company which was established in 1911 and I have some information right here because I don't want to screw up on history facts so I have my laptop here with some information and I'm going to try to give you a broader understanding of what this company uh, history is and it was established in 1911 by Mr. Sakata and his brother and the first name of the company was Sakata Manufactory and they were producing solid gold nibs. So we have a pen company which started as manufacturing solid gold nibs. 110 years and even past that of knowledge, history and manufacturing a product will give you a pretty good understanding of nibs and fountain pens and for that alone I do respect a lot this brand and uh, I do think this is one of the most greatest things that we could do uh, to associate with such partners and to actually believe in their lineup of writing instruments and to welcome them in our website. In 1917, the factory relocated to the next town, Hamadacho, and the company changed the name to Sailor Pan Sakata Manufactory CEO Ltd. The company started manufacturing fountain pens there in the volumes. And uh, keep this word in your mind, volume, because Sailor has a huge potential in regards of offering variety and volume. And not only that, very, very good quality products in volume. This is very, very important to keep in mind. The company reached a turning point around 27th of May 1926 when the Imperial Prince Hirohito visited the factory to encourage the industry. This was a great honor for a small company with 300 employees established only 15 years previously. So you can imagine it's not a small company. It's quite a big one. 300 employees in 1926. This is big, guys. This is very, very important. And uh, this is a pan company which you have to have your eyes on. Moving further, taking this opportunity, the Sailor Pan Company acquired a significant credibility and notoriety nationwide. Starting in 1929, fountain pens with gold nibs became very popular and the company continuously developed unique and innovative products for the Japanese stationery industry. In 1949, Sailor invented the plastic injection machine and started mass producing Japan's first fountain pens using plastic. That, my friends, is another milestone in Japan's stationery industry, which uh, was marked by Sailor. I, I just love this history facts. Don't get me wrong, fountain pens are fine, fountain pens are nice, interesting, but when you read through 110 years of history and a company which so well reflects the Japanese standards and the culture and the fine balance in between colors, 
uh, technology, uh, heritage, and puts them so well together, my friends, this is impressive. And you need to understand that if you want to broaden your horizon in regards of writing instruments, you will most likely have to try a Sailor fountain pen or a Sailor nib to be more specific. Because I think if you don't have it, you are missing out on something big. It's 110 years of history and we could talk all day long about this history and all of the facts. And when I read this, I get goosebumps because I am imagining everything. Anyway, we are going to skip a little bit and we are going to arrive in our times now, 2022, because we have something very important. In 2022, they actually started to rebuild the Hiroshima factory. So I told you, they moved into a second town uh, when they started and now they are rebuilding the old factory. The initial location of the factory is in a city called Kure, Hiroshima, which is a port city. The logo, anchor, and the color, which is that uh, dawn blue, it's picked with a purpose. And I love that in every single detail, you find a reason why that is there. And I'm gonna give you a nugget of information, which is located on their website. There is a commemorative fountain pen from the rebuilding of the Hiroshima factory, which we are going to get. And that fountain pen, it's made out of the wood which was chopped down the overgrown wood around the factory. So they actually don't throw away that wood. They do it in fountain pens. And uh, I'm gonna get one of those for me. I don't know about you, but one of those is gonna be mine. From here, I would like to say that I do like to work with teams which share the same passion, the same um, moral values like we do at Penventure. And when Sailor Europe introduced us to the distributor in our country, after getting to talk a little bit, we were just simply amazed by how much help we received from them and how much we could relate one to the other and our moral values and everything. And for me, it was like a home run. I said, this is the type of team which we think that we deserve to sit. And I gave it my all. We took on a big commitment. We took this brand with great responsibility and with great respect for what it is. I spent a lot of time researching, finding out what is special about each and every single pen, how they are made, what are their models, their colors, which is specific to certain types of pens and what not. And I tried to know my thing about Sailor Fountain Pens. When you put everything together, you will find out that in our website, you don't find things that I don't have a particular connection to. And this particular connection, it's not reflected by only a good product it's reflected by a whole array of moral values, a good team behind, good logistics, uh, a great writing experience with that pen, uh, great customer support. If we can email someone and I have a person opening up the email calling me, for me, it's better. And this is what we are looking for to have. You know by now that pen venture is tailored to offer a more personal approach to fountain pen purchases, inks and everything. And I do believe that in the future, our partnerships will be established only on this basis. When we have a good team to talk with, when we have a very good quality product that I personally like to collect, to own, to have, and to stand behind. And then it is if that specific brand has credibility, respects the customers, and takes on to innovate and to actually add value to our fountain pen community. And this is the reason why we choose Sailor Pen Company. We are fortunate, we are happy, and we are respectful for this opportunity. And we are 
serious about offering you the entire Sailor fountain pens and inks and everything that you want from Sailor. Now that we got this out of the way, I'm going to show you what we got for the inventory. And I hope you have some time because there are a lot of fountain pens. And when I say we were serious, we were serious. We do have, I believe, I would say like 80, 85% or even more so of the entire offering of writing instruments from Sailor. And I'm going to show you uh, briefly a few of them. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to subscribe. Click down below, turn the notification bell on. This will help us a lot. And uh, also give the thumbs up. This will help me with the YouTube algorithm to reach out to many more just like you. If you want to support Penventure and myself. And let's go through the fountain pens. I'm going to show you something which caught my eye. And this is a line of writing instruments from Sailor based on the 1911, which has steel nibs. And I do believe they are so pretty. And uh, this is what we've got if you want to try something from Sailor at a lower cost, this is a great start. And I'm gonna go briefly. So we do have a lot of this trace and uh, let's see. Here we have the Sailor Pro Gear Mini Series, which is a very nice pocket fountain pen with a 14 karat gold nib. And if you post this, it's a wonderful pocket rocket. Very, very cheeky and nice fountain pen, which I did like and we do have a few colors of it so if you are looking for something which fits in uh, that small pocket of your jeans and if you want to take it out and to enjoy it you have it right here at pen venture from sailor you pretty much have two fountain pen models either the flat ends and the cigar shape all of the cigar shapes are 1911 cold and all of the flat ends are pro gear. There are different sizes, so I showed you the mini, and we are going to go into the pro gear slim. And there is a lot of fountain pens in this series, and uh, it's flat at ends, and this is the Christmas pudding based on the collection which reflects the tea ceremony in different cultures. We have Fika, we have Halagrotha, we have this one, which is Christmas pudding, and there is also a Pro Gear King Size Orange in the same collection, which looks stunning, and I'm gonna show you that one uh, in a few moments. We have Demonstrator, we have Black, we have Sapporo Color, we have uh, the ones which are Demonstrator, like this one, and uh, right here, let's see, Storm Over the Ocean, Pro Gear Slim. Sailor Pro Gear Riallo. The Riallo series implies that the fountain pen is equipped with a internal piston and an ink window. And uh, here we have a Pro Gear Riallo. And this is stunning. I do believe it's a little bit bigger than uh, the Pro Gear Slim in regards of length and girth, but it looks nice and the piston filling mechanism helps. Every single fountain pen which is not Riallo is using the Sailor proprietary ink cartridge. They do have an ink converter, which is proprietary to Sailor provided with them. Moving further, what do we have here? The Sailor Pro Gear Regular. So we are going increasingly in uh, length and size. And this fountain pen's series are equipped with 21 karat gold nibs. And we do have a, here a color orange one. Don't get me started with the orange and black combination because it looks stunning. And we do have plenty of them. Now tell me this is not pretty because I won't believe you. <laughs> Let's see. Let's see the next trade. So we took on a big commitment. So if you are looking for a sailor, 99% sure you're going to find it with us. Let's see what else. Same Sailor Pro Gear regular series. And we have here Sunset Over the Ocean. Here we have Storm Over the Ocean. We have Fika. It's a blue pan and I love blue pans. And this one caught my eye from the first moment. It's so beautiful and it is based on the, the Nordic uh, ceremony of having a tea and a cake. We have a beautiful, beautiful stellar black hole limited production fountain pen. And this is a regular with a 21 karat gold nib and this barrel with the sparkly black contrasted by this stunning 
um, yellow looks gorgeous the only thing which it is not yet completely completely available at Penvenger in regards of sailor is the actual nib range we strive to offer most of the nib options like extra fine fine medium fine medium broad zoom music but on certain fountain pens we don't have them we order them and at one point we will have them available anyway if you're looking for a specific nib size you can ask us and we can bring it on on order for you and let's see what do we have next the sailor pro gear shikiori and these fountain pens are available uh, into a box with a bottle of ink if i'm not mistaking shikiori ink from sailor and you can buy that separately at pen venture as well and here it is the sailor pro gear slim manio and seasonal festivals and this comes with a bottle of ink let me know if you have a certain type of writing experience that you are looking for to get in a sailor you can write it down in the order notes i will personally check your nib and make sure that it's going to have that writing experience and i have here the sailor 1911 riallo 21 karat gold nib and the riallo series like i told you it's equipped with a piston an ink window beautiful cigar shaped fountain pens this is this is the staple fountain pen which is simple elegant exquisite if i want to go classy i would pick a 1911 if i want to go fancy i would pick a pro gear because i do love that flat ends let's go into the 1911 large we're slowly building up towards the big fountain pens from the sailor uh, lineup and we have here the white the demonstrator the black one which looks stunning it is a fountain pen which reflects a very very classy style and i do love this a lot okay okay have you got bored of so many pens well stay tuned because the best is coming now so the last fountain pens we had the the the, the 1911 so let's go with the same overall 1911-ish theme and we have the king of pan ebony which is the 149 of sailor it is the flagship fountain pen made out of ebony with a lot of craftsmanship and a mixture in between uh, the size and the 21 carat gold nib which is the big one these fountain pens are exuberant the way they write the way they feel the way they look the way that they make you appreciate them it's out of this world these nibs are available in only two sizes medium and broad and i don't know about you but i don't think i want more sizes because if there were more sizes i would have got them all and we have here the ebonite version both in silver trim and in gold trim retro uh, vibe the vintage fountain pen which screams uh, luxury in my opinion and this nib is a two-tone uh, 21 karat gold medium this has a new imprint the 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 sailor anchor king of pan with the rings and uh, again a stunning appearance this orange and now let's go to the pro gear king size remember that because i had a few years in which i called this series the pro gear king of pan but there isn't such a thing the pro gear series biggest fountain pen it's called the king size not the king of pan we do have the classic black with gold black with silver trims demonstrator and the special ones winter skies fika christmas the orange one like i told you this incredible fountain pen and i do have two more special fountain pens from sailor which i want to show you because they deviate from the normal range of fountain pens and i do have them right here so give me a moment this is called the ebonite sculpture and i do have two of them and this is the one which is completely smooth and this is the one with the rings and there is another one with some lines and this is a big fountain pen from sailor no clip but they do have this pen roll and this is a large pen so imagine the length of this one and it's 
it's so elegant and it's so precise and balanced and we already sold one of this and the feedback was impressive so if you want to have something different from sailor give this one a try because you won't regret this is how it looks we do have a lot of this fountain pens and you can find them if you go on the Van Venture website, I'm going to leave you the link down below. You can go there. You can search through them. We are going to do our best to showcase this impressive products in some of our more artistic photography soon in our studio. Anyway, till then, I look forward to give them a proper introduction in some of our reviews. If you want to see a video review of a certain pen from Sailor that you've seen right here, or if you have it in your mind, Comment down below, let me know what you think about uh, the Sailor Pen Company, the, the brand, um, what you think about Pen Venture carrying the entire Sailor series, fountain pens, inks, you can find Manio inks, Shikiori inks, and soon I hope to bring the entire uh, studio series of ink from Sailor. Also, let me know your opinion about how do we pick our partners, how do we pick the teams that we stand behind, and uh, let me know what do you want to see next uh, brought at Pen Venture. And uh, from here, I will leave you to go on our website and to search and to find your favorite Sailor Fountain Pen. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for spending this time with me on the Pen Venture YouTube channel. If you want to support the growth of the Pen Venture YouTube channel, don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up. This will help me a lot with the YouTube algorithm. Subscribe right there if you want to continue watching my videos. I'm going to leave you this right here. You can click and enjoy. As always, I'm your host, Amy from Panvedger, and I'll forward seeing you next video. Take care, stay safe, bye-bye.